Hello everyone, welcome to a very boring education on how to learn about homonyms and homophones by reading a book called How Much Can a Bear Bear Bear? What are homonyms and homophones? For short reason, homonyms are two or more words that are pronounced the same and spelled the same but are different meaning. Homophones are two or more words that are pronounced the same but have different spelling and different meaning. Wow! Homonyms are words that sound and also look alike, but they have different meaning, as in, can you pass that can, Mike? Or, May, I'll sail you in May and coast along the coast. These words are a blast if you can say them quite fast. Like, why don't we toast with some toast? A light may be light, like a small paper kite. A trunk can be found in a trunk. An inchworm and snail could be scale on a scale. A lean cat could lean on a skunk. But punch cannot punch. And at breakfast or lunch, your jam cannot jam on a trumpet. A bowl cannot bowl, but a roll might just roll if it's not made of flat as a crumpet. Now, some words sound identical but are spelled in different ways. These words are known as homophones, like phrase and praise and praise. Though homophones have matching sound, their meaning aren't the same. And there isn't any question, they're as fun as any game. A bee can be, a flea can flee, a burrow can burrow a hole. A horse can get horse from taking of course, a ewe could take you on a stroll. A fowl can be foul, a toad can be toad, a hare mustn't air in the air. A whale can wail. A male can male. A pair might just pair a big pair. A bus can be busted by a driver you trust. And bury and bury and bury. A band could be banded if they get out of hand. And Mary, who's Mary, can marry. But the sea cannot see, and it's clear as can be that a ball will not ball when it's rolled. A moose has no use for a bottle of moose, and a creek doesn't creak when it's old. But a bear should be bare, and it wouldn't be rare if wood wouldn't be kept in a shed. A shear might be Sue, and he knew that the brew that he brought wasn't new, like you said. My nice could be grease, both in grease and in nice. A check could be written in a check. A maid could be made to be very afraid when she heard a big herd on the deck. You could search the whole world while it spun and whirled. In and in and beneath every stone, and you'll find no more pleasures than these great farber teasers, the homonyms and homophones. So what are homonyms and what are homophones? Do you know? Now that I know, a homonym is basically a word that has a lot of meaning to it. Like bat can be a baseball bat or the bat that lives inside a cage. A homophone is basically plenty of words that sound the same but has plenty of different meanings. That's all for this lesson today. And please leave a like, subscribe if you enjoy this lesson from a terrible teacher like me. I can not teach students. I'm very sorry. That's my apology there. Have a great day, night, evening, or whatever you are on this world. Have a good day. Reality could be a torture. Bye.